Are you under attack? Tired, rejected, or lonely? Sharing all your feelings with God because he wants to listen to everything you're going through. Do you ever feel overwhelmed by stress? Life can throw so many challenges our way, leaving us feeling tired, anxious, and drained. But here's some good news. You don't have to face it all on your own. God can handle your stress. He cares about every detail of your life, including the burdens weighing you down. When you feel like your world is falling apart, turn to God. Pour out your heart to Him in prayer and let Him know what you're going through. He's always listening, ready to comfort you and guide you through the rough times. In the midst of your stress, it's important to remember that God is in control. He's not surprised by your struggles and has the power to work everything together for your good. Trust in His plan even when it seems difficult or uncertain. One way to find peace in the face of stress is to meditate on God's promises. Open up your Bible and reflect on His words. You'll be reminded of His faithfulness, strength, and love, giving you the courage to persevere. Finally, remember that you are not alone. Connect with family or friends of believers who can offer support encouragement and prayer. Share your burdens with one another and experience the power of unity in Christ. So, if stress is overwhelming you today, take a moment to pause, breathe deeply, and turn to God. He can handle it all. Everyone goes through tough times when stress can feel overwhelming, but the Bible's teachings can give us the strength to continue Trust in God during confusing times and manage stress during hard moments. This video will share insights. We often face challenging periods where we struggle and feel overwhelmed. Keep watching until the end. A vital message is coming up that can reshape your life. Stress is a big problem in today's fast and busy world. Everything is too quick, loud, and too much, making us feel overwhelmed. We get a lot of information from newspapers, social media magazines, TV, and our phones. Makes it hard for us to relax and rest. Our daily schedules are crazy. We never have enough time to do everything we need to do. We're always rushing and feeling stressed, tired, and frustrated. We often feel so stressed that we think we might burst. This kind of stress really affects how confident we feel. Spectators at a race often shout, keep going, to motivate the athletes. That's also great advice for anyone who feels emotionally, mentally, or spiritually exhausted from running the marathon of life. God will give us the power to finish what he has called us to do. We often feel overwhelmed because we try to control things more than necessary. And sometimes we don't even notice we're doing it. How important it is to follow Jesus' lead, as He loves us and has wonderful plans for us. The Bible offers us guidance and strength to persevere, to have faith in God, even when things are hard to understand, and to cope with stress in the toughest situations. What does Jesus say when we come to Him with an emptiness in our lives, an empty soul, heart, and character? How does he respond when we tell him we have nothing to give? God will never scold you or turn you away. He will always say, come to me. Some things are not exactly bad. They're just not needed. Understanding this will help you get through tough times more easily. You'll become stronger. You will know what to choose, what's really important, and things that matter forever. Some people in your life might have bad intentions, feel jealous, say hurtful things and cause you pain. This is something you can't avoid. We can be sure that God is aware, cares about us, and will make things right. Our society always tries to shape you to its standards. If you're unsure about who you are, it's easier for society's ideas to influence you. You need to know who you are in Christ. Understand 
and accept that God loves you without any conditions. When lots of changes happen in your life, it's important to spend more time with God. Read the Bible, talk to God, and listen to what He tells you. It is very important to spend time with God daily, to feel peaceful and relaxed. Pain, pressure, people, and problems often make us unhappy. They can really bring us down. Being happy isn't about what happens to us. It's something we can choose for ourselves. A lot of times, we pay more attention to our troubles rather than to God. This makes us lose sight of the bigger, lasting picture we need to keep moving forward through tough times. God is there to support us when we feel like quitting. It's easy to be happy when everything is good, but God shows you how to find real joy even when you're facing tough times, sadness, or heartache. God can bring peace into the most troubled situations. This story is about a young woman named Sarah. She had a heart full of dreams and a stressful world. Sarah's days were packed with work, family responsibilities, and the constant buzz of a busy life. It felt like a heavy weight on her shoulders, a weight she couldn't shake off. One day, feeling overwhelmed, Sarah took a walk in the neighborhood. As she wandered, she came across an old, serene chapel. Curiosity led her inside. The chapel was quiet and peaceful, a stark contrast to the chaos of her life. She sat down on a pew, closed her eyes, and for the first time in a long time, she found a moment of peace in that quiet chapel. Sarah began to talk to God. She poured out her heart, sharing her worries, her stress, and her longing for peace. It was a simple, honest conversation, like talking to a dear friend. As she spoke, she felt a weight lifting from her shoulders. Days turned into weeks, and Sarah made her visits to the chapel a regular habit. She found solace in these quiet moments with God. She began to read the Bible, finding stories of people who faced great challenges but overcame them with faith. These stories inspired her and gave her strength. As Sarah's faith grew, she started to see changes in her life. She learned to trust in God's plan to let go of her need to control everything. She discovered the power of prayer in asking for help and thanking for the blessings in her life. She found joy in small things and learned to take life one day at a time. Sarah also began to share her journey with others in the village. She told them about the peace she found in faith and the strength she gained from her relationship with God. Her story inspired many, and soon the chapel became a place of gathering for those seeking comfort and guidance. As time went on, Sarah's life was still busy, but the stress no longer controlled her. She had found a balance, a way to navigate life's challenges with faith and grace. She became a beacon of hope in her community, a living testament to the power of overcoming stress through faith. In the end, Sarah's story was not just about overcoming stress, but about transforming her life. She found a deeper purpose, a connection to something greater than herself. Her journey was a reminder that in the midst of our busiest, most stressful moments, peace can be found and strength can be gained in the quiet moments of faith and trust in God. Overcoming stress through faith in God can be a powerful way to find peace and strength. Believe that God has a purpose for your life. Stress often comes from trying to control everything. By trusting in God's plan, you can let go of this burden. Remember, God's plans are often beyond our understanding, but they're always for our good. Find comfort in scriptures that remind you of God's promises and love. Regular prayer and meditation can significantly reduce stress. When you pray, you're communicating with God, casting your worries onto Him. In quiet meditation, you can feel God's presence which brings peace and clarity. This practice helps you focus on what's important 
and lets you surrender your stress to God. The Bible is full of wisdom and encouragement that can help you deal with stress. Verses like Philippians 4, 6, 7, do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. Offer comfort. Regular reading and reflection on such verses can provide guidance and reassurance. Being part of a faith community offers support and a sense of belonging. Sharing your struggles with fellow believers can lighten your burden. They can offer prayers, advice, and encouragement. In return, supporting others in their time of need can also bring fulfillment and reduce stress. Engaging in worship and praise is a way to shift your focus from your problems to God's greatness. Singing hymns, listening to spiritual music, or attending a worship service can uplift your spirit. It's a reminder that God is in control and deserving of your trust and praise. Helping others can be therapeutic. Engaging in acts of kindness and service brings a sense of joy and purpose that counteracts stress. When you're helping others, you're also serving God, which can bring a deep sense of peace and satisfaction. Taking care of your body is also a way to honor God. A healthy lifestyle, proper diet, exercise, and enough sleep can greatly reduce stress levels. Remember, your body is a temple of the Holy Spirit. Taking care of it is a form of worship. Sometimes, stress can be overwhelming, and it's okay to seek professional help. Consulting with a counselor or therapist, especially one who respects your faith, can provide additional support and coping strategies. There's no shame in asking for help. It's a step towards healing. Overcoming stress in God's way involves a combination of faith, prayer, community support, and practical self-care. Each of these plays a vital role in helping you find peace and strength. In the midst of life's challenges, remember, God is always with you, offering His love, guidance, and comfort. Heavenly Father, in Your grace and wisdom, guide me through life's challenges. In moments of stress and uncertainty, Grant me peace and clarity. Strengthen my heart and mind so I may face difficulties with courage and calmness. Lord, I'm feeling overwhelmed. I find myself losing patience and getting annoyed quickly. I tend to respond too fast. My worries are weighing heavily on me. I notice how stress is impacting me. Please guide me in finding relief from my stress and anxiety in the way you would want. Remind me of your constant presence, assuring me that I am not alone. Help me to trust in your plan, knowing you are with me every step. Provide me with patience and resilience, and let your love be my anchor. Teach me to find rest and rejuvenation in you, and guide me in managing my stress with faith and confidence. Amen. Thanks for watching this video. We hope it's brought you a sense of peace and encouragement. If this message has blessed you, write Amen in the comment section. Subscribe, like, and share it with others to uplift them in the Lord. May you find peace and spiritual enlightenment on your journey.